This video is about how I've been with CMHC since I was 20 years old. Um, it's also about, like, all the wrongs and rights and the in-betweens. Um, as a young person, it's also about who I am and what I've been through. But as a young person, I was... Uh, Poor kid learning how to be a man. And my grandfather was a big influence in my life. He taught me about how to work, how to farm, how to do a lot of things. And my friends, I had some friends, they were major influences in my life too. And we were all doing a lot of crazy things whenever I was from the age of 12 up to about 19 years old. And um, I gave all that up and I tried to live uh, an adult-like normal life. And, um, you know, things came along, a lot of stress, a lot of different kinds of people because I was so poor. I lived around poor people and not to say that just because you're poor that you're a bad person, but I happen to meet a lot of poor people with a lot of problems. I'm sure someday they'll, but, you know, maybe they won't. I don't know. But so far, uh, my guilty sins are basically dealing with other people, uh, being at the wrong place at the wrong time. And not only that, um, allowing myself to believe that people I can trust are, are people that I can trust. And not only that, I've made a few stupid mistakes, you know, with uh, women and partying and doing drugs on occasion. But, like, other than that, like, I try to maintain a somewhat of a normal life. Uh, I'm kind of a rowdy, rough neck kind of guy. Uh, but I, I generally do treat people with respect. And I think people got me pinned down wrong. I'm just, um, I've been through a lot of you, the story is huge. It really is. A lot of other people act crazy in my life. Um, I've seen all kinds of stuff. The world, in my mind, is a bad place. And I don't want it to be bad. I want much better. I have a child of my own. He's not mine. He lives with his mother. But I want him to be happy. I want him to be a better person than me. And I want to help him through that. And I've been down every road. And I obviously am not good enough. I, at this point, I don't really know how to give him what he really needs. I hope that he finds it. Um, but at this point in my life, I'm not sure that I'm really going to be able to help him. So this is going to be very daunting. But somehow i got to fix myself. Because the doctors can't do it and they're lying to me. Uh, they're causing problems. 